Hello everyone, Aster is here and welcome in Narto Berlin district, the last new zone of Underdark series, written by Robert Anthony Salvatore. Nardo Berlin bring us the new model 26, called Demo Web Pits, but it also bring us a new adventure called The Hero's Path, but we are gonna talk about it in a new detailed video soon. Today in this video we show you the new zone, the new features they had, which are abyssal hands, and I will talk a show about all the new gear they put in this new campaign. So yeah, like all the Underdark campaign, it, uh, it is a 10 weeks campaign which is 7 Myson, which gave us rewards. This is important, I think, for some players who can't afford to complete Master Toss, because this pack should be give them one over the ring of the do Dark Maiden Blessing equipment, and of course, the bottom rewards are on per account and the le the upper one are for characters they also added a store which generic things like the demo web key needed for open the hand chest in demo web beats dungeon so the new dungeon they added some new entity packs some overlords and also two new type of insignias three new enchantments and one new combat enchantment but seems like a copy paste of living X and added the something others so I guess it will be updated in the future we will see they also added the new gear which is basically the brigand earth equipment coming from Mezzoberanzen campaign and now we can like exalt those items in fact we have new currency here which is needed to upgrade them they also add some new items starting from these weapons perfect jewel or lolt is not written where we can find them but they have a lot of item level and the bonus seems to me like lion art and uh, watcher weapons mix it together or something like this then they added the abyssal gear which can find in the advanced and the master version of the dungeon i guess here i want to show you some of the items which are legendary at the start and then we can upgrade them to the mythic and one good thing is for example when they are legendary look this they are giving here rating 3000 critical strike and forte but when they become legendary they become percentages gain three percent critical strike and forte so yeah the upgrade seems really worth for some of them we will see how we can make this new gear they also added this new ring new rings which i guess they are coming from the dungeon also legendary rings but I don't have any clue where we can find them they also added the new artifact set this one is like a new version of the apocalypse set and actually this new apocalypse set so the marilith mask set it's stuck with the old apocalypse set so it's really really good especially in end game respect then we have this one realm engine core which seems like the bonus it's a copy paste from 
Dragon Bomb Veil set or Wyvern set could be probably useful. And this one set is like an Alastair set, but they also added the AP gain increase, so maybe they will be worth using this. They also had the uh, new shirts and pants, which can be found in the heroic encounters in uh, the new zone, Nardo Belly, and also legendary shirts and pants. And as you can see, they have a set bonus like the dragon hands, shirts, and pants, and in this case, the bonus is 3% AP gain. I think they are so so good, so can't wait to find them and testing on my characters. They had all of this, so we are going to understand how to drop all of these new items, this new gear, which is really interesting for some items and for some classes. They are really really good. This one will be the new kind of enclave zone where we are gonna take all the weekly quests, daily quests to progress on the campaign. There are also some new kind of NPC. This will be the NPCs for the hands. I will talk about them in a future video. This one is an NPC with foods, which is basically a copy pass from Guild Food, and it costs just Nardobelling currency, which comes from American counters and from quests. And they also added Masterwork Artisan. I can't actually show you them because of my wizard, I don't have any of the Masterwork upgraded, so. I will talk about them in a future detailed video where we are gonna explain and talk about new masterwork of Menz Baranzen. So yeah, I showed you some of the new gear but was so fast so I made two documents which you can find in the description of the video, one with all the items coming from the campaign like the abyssal master gear we seen the shirt the rings the artifact set the brigand earth exalted for all classes and i made another document with the showcase of masterwork so here in the description you can find them and give a shout out to them we will see you soon guys thanks for watching these videos and bye to everyone